in shopkeeper allows a 28 percentage discount on the marked price of an article and still makes a profit of 30 percentage if he gains 39.9 rupees on sale of one article then what is the marked price of the article here profit is same as gain so here profit is 30 percentage and gain is 39.9 rupees which means 30 percentage profit is equal to 39.9 rupees now 10 percentage is equal to 13.3 rupees means 100 percentage is the cost to price 100 percentage is equal to 133 rupees Profit is always based on cost price because this profit is made from cost to price. So cost to price is 100 percentage, 100 percentage is equal to 133 rupees. Now we have cost to price as 133 rupees and we have mark price and sell price. Now gain is 39.9 rupees means 133 plus 39.9 rupees is sell price. Cost price plus profit is sell price. 133 plus 40 is 173. So 173 minus 0.1 is 172.9. Now we don't know what is mark price. But here question says shopkeeper allows 28 percentage discount. And this discount is on this mark price. So we don't know what is mark price. But shopkeeper allows 28 percentage discount. So this 28 percentage discount leads to the sell price. Which means if I consider 100 percentage as mark price, then 100 minus 28 lead to the sell price. That is 72 percentage. 100 minus 28 is equal to 72 percentage. So this 72 percentage leads to the sell price 172.9. So 72 percentage is 172.9 rupees. Then we need to find what is 100 percentage. 100 percentage means mark price because this discount is based on this mark price that is discount is allowed on this mark price this discount is made from this mark price so 100 percentage is mark price which is equal to 172.9 divided by 72 into 100 now if i divide it with 4 4 goes 18 times in 72 here 4 goes 4 times in 16 remaining 4 goes 3 times in 12 remaining 2 Two. So here if I divide 43 with 18 it will be around 2.4. So 2.4 into 100 is equal to 240 rupees. So option 2 is your answer.